Hi, I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies. In today's SQL Payroll System tutorial, I'll talk about creation and activation for a new company. So, once you purchase SQL after the installations, normally the first thing that you should do is go to the login screen and you can see now you only have the testing company. So at the right hand side of the company name, click on the three dot button. When you're at this screen, what you need to do is click on create new database. Click on it. So put in your company name, let's say syntax technologies. Remember hard. What is the year? Maybe to overlay. And do remember the database name is called pay-002 or any other you can't recognize the name. So what you should do is just put in your company name again in short form, no problem. Something like this. Okay. And dot FDP. Click on OK. The reason we do not use back the same name as given by the system is because just in case anything happened to SQL, sometimes for support wise we need to get the physical database. So imagine anything happened, and we go to your C drive, eStream, SQL payroll, DB. You have many companies, then you are not able to recognize which is which, but after you rename, then no problems. You should do this during the restore uh, process, which I will explain in the next video. As I mentioned, example, I asked you, what is this company? You cannot tell me. So that's why for support wise, it's very important that you should rename your database name. Now, so what happened is you already create the new company. So here. Okay, so then you can select the new company. The first time login, username admin, password also admin. Login. If you have purchased the system, then you should get the activation code from your dealer. So how to do that? The first thing is you go to file, company profile, the company name, key in all the necessary information, but most important is the address. You need to key properly. Okay, key in the address, phone, and so on. After you key in, save it, close it, go to file again. Now this time is go to product activation. So you need to key product ID and activation code, but you still have not received from your dealer. So to do this, you need to request first. Then only your dealer can send to you. So to do. Just go to print activation request, maximize it. Of course, remember the address should use the proper address, right? Then click on this button. This is the export icon, arrow down, export to PDF. Click OK. Maybe put at your desktop, give a name. The name maybe is syntax or your company name, then SQL payroll activate request okay so make it meaningful then email sorry then attach this request and email to your dealer and only within three working days your dealer will reply to you with activation code which looks something like this okay which looks something like this so you will have your product ID who is your dealer contact and company name, address, okay? So let's say you have multiple company, then you can request again, you create a company and request again. So remember, every company will have different activation code, okay? You have three company, you need to request three times because you will have different activation code. You cannot request one time and use the same activation code for different company. It, it doesn't look like that, okay? So you will see DJ A, DJ B, ignore it okay basically it's a checking for, for for our system and you just can copy the product id go back to your sql payroll go to file go to uh, product activation 
put it down over here product ID then check the activation code just copy and put it inside the activation code and you will notice once everything is correct the digit A and digit B will be exactly same as the activations form okay then what you need to do is just click register once you register the company name under company profile the company name will be in yellow color then it means that you already activated the software it's very important once you install you should do these steps because else you may be blocked using the system after one time of uh, processing okay so over here also very important is it will also stated what is your package is like this package is for 20 stuff then it's a standalone copy okay so basically this is how you're going to create a new company and also how to activate the company for continuous usage if you are interested in SK payroll or accounting system feel free to contact me or you just want to sign in with us you are welcome once again thank you for watching i'm brian from syntax technologies thank you